Hi, Ella. I'm Dr. Sharp, one of VJ's colleagues. Of course, double French roast splash of agave. Yep. <laughs> so I'm sorry, I'm not standing. I just, I'm worried that if I get out of this chair, VJ's gonna die during surgery. I have OCD, and my irrational thoughts won this round. It happens. Ah, I wish it hadn't, because sitting is making my leg cramps worse. I stretch, but they just keep coming back. How long's that been going on? Um, an hour or two. I woke up breathing better for the first time in months, but my back gets hot, and now this. And I don't know, my pregnancy podcast said I was gonna start feeling confident and sexy. Ella, it sounds like you're in labor. Contractions are organized and four minutes apart. It's official. What's official? Ella, you're gonna have a baby today. Oh, uh, no, that's impossible, because my due date's in three weeks. On a Friday, and today's Tuesday. And Dr. Richardson was gonna deliver my baby? Oh, looks like someone wants to crash this party early. I'll be coming for Dr. Richardson all day, so I think we'll be seeing a lot of each other. I'll be back in a bit to check on your progress. Thank you. Uh, this is not OCD, this is a relaxation exercise. Good, no good, relaxing is good. How is this happening? I am not ready for this. Is there someone that you would like me to call? Your family, friends? No, there's only VJ, and he promised he'd be here for this. Um, okay, uh, who, uh, you could try my doula, but I think she's in Portland this weekend for her great aunt's birthday, so that feels like a dead end. I know, I know a great doula here in New Amsterdam. Has she been working with me for the last 26 weeks on ways to manage my OCD for this specific moment? Uh, I had a plan. I had such a perfect plan. Oh. Surgical tweet prep to OR7. SSP OR7. Uh, Leela, hi. Can you clear my afternoon, please? No pages, no patients, nothing. What are you doing? I'm kicking off your new plan. You're fully effaced and dilated, but the baby's still at minus three position. Ella, the delivery isn't progressing as I'd hoped. What does that mean? When your next contraction comes, you need to push real hard. Oh my god, this is a disaster. Maybe you could hold her hand. Uh, Ella, look, look at, count them out with me, okay? Whoa! Here we go. Give me the biggest push you've got. You can do this, come on, come on. No, I can't, I stop, I don't want to. What if the baby's not okay? What if I heard it? What if I ate undercooked meat and didn't know it? And seven weeks ago I took a bath right after the tub was cleaned and the water probably had bleach in it. What kind of mom is that careless? You are not careless. You have a disorder that sends your pregnancy into overdrive, but you fought it and you've made it this far. I cheated. I got scans all the time. Sometimes two days in a row in case something happened while I was sleeping. But then everything shut down and BJ got sick and I don't know why, but I just convinced myself that the baby was gonna be okay as long as he was okay. What if BJ's not okay? Ella, everything on that monitor says that your baby is going to be okay, but you have to deliver it. No! Oh! Contractions peaking. Yeah! Come on, you can do it. Your baby needs you to push now. God! <laughs> You've got this. You can do it. Yeah.